Okay guys, so we're gonna be making a pak choy and red bell pepper rice. Okay, so first I'm gonna put some oil in my pot here. So here I have two cloves of garlic, I have some red bell pepper and some onion. So we're just gonna saute this a little. Oh, and I also have some turmeric cut up in here as well. See this here? This is turmeric. So we're gonna saute this. I'm gonna add a little bit of salt to it. So I'm gonna add about a teaspoon and a half of salt to this, to the rice. I have two cups of rice that I'm using and I'm using jasmine rice. Now usually when you're cooking rice, you do one cup of rice to two cups of water. I actually like to put a little less water so I don't put the full amount. Um, the thing about it is that my pot that I use to cook my rice, I have the lid for it is very heavy. This is, a, this is a, like a ceramic type pot. So the lid that I have is extremely heavy. And so because of that, I am able to, when I cook my rice, my jasmine rice that is, I usually put on my timer for eight minutes. So I will bring it up to a boil. Then I will cover it, turn it down to low, put on my timer for eight minutes. When the timer goes off after eight minutes, I turn off the, the stove and I leave it covered for a further five minutes. And that would usually cook cook my rice, that's how I cook my rice, right? So if you, if you have a nice heavy cover for your pot, then that's good. Now what I'm going to do this time around is I, um, I have already dissolved a gnawed chicken stock cube in some water. You see, I've already dissolved that. So in that way, it will add extra flavor to my rice. All right, so that's good here. What I'm going to do now is add my rice and fry up my rice grains. To add some extra flavor to my rice, I'm going to use some Mrs. Dash garlic and herb season blend. So I'm just going to leave this, um, fry it up for a little longer, and then I'll be back. All right, so let's add in the pak choy. And then we're going to add in our liquids now. Right, I have to add in another cup and a half. So I just did a cup and a half. And I'm going to do another cup and a half. Between a cup and a half and a cup and three quarter. All right. I'm just going to stir everybody now. By the way, guys, this is pak choy that I picked from my garden. It's so nice to be able to go out in your garden, pick produce, and then come back inside and cook with it. I really love that. Feel free to check out my gardening playlist. I have one on this channel, and I also have one on um, my other channel, Lawful's Videos 2, that's T-W-O, 
there's a gardening playlist so you can check that out if you enjoy gardening all right so let's bring this up to a boil and then we will move on to the next step okay so now that this is bubbling i'm going to cover it i'm going to turn my fire down to low and i'm going to put on my timer for eight minutes after eight minutes i'm turning off the stove and i'm leaving it covered for further five minutes okay guys so our rice is now completed <laughs> 